Hello and welcome to another Blu-ray unboxing video. This time around, instead of the Japanese uh, space superhero fantasy affair, I thought I would go with some European dragon sword and sorcerer sort of affair. Uh, this time around, we have Dragon Slayer. Uh, I've seen this movie a long time ago, did enjoy it, and I've, wanting, I've been wanting to revisit it uh, because I've seen the similarly titled Dawn of the Dragon Slayer. When you see the uh, side of it, in one of those Walmart bins or something. It always caught my eye, and I always thought it was the original, you know, the real Dragon Slayer. Uh, and it always just kind of bummed me out because I couldn't find it. Uh, I found this thing for a dollar a while back. I haven't watched it yet, but the real Dragon Slayer dropped in price, and I went ahead and grabbed it off of Amazon. Uh, once again, the disc, uh, I don't know if you'll hear it. It has come loose. There it is. It has come loose yet again. This is why I don't like uh, ordering DVDs off of Amazon. You never know if they're going to show up in good condition. This is a Blu-ray, so I'm hoping it will uh, be relatively you know, mark-free or they'll wipe off. Uh, take a closer look at the special features before I pop it open. You do get a commentary with the director and Guillermo del Toro, which uh, sounds pretty interesting. Let's see what uh, del Toro has to say. You get some screen tests and the uh, the Slayer of All Dragons, which I believe is some sort of special feature on how they made the dragons and all that, uh, both in HD, which is pretty rad, as well as the original theatrical trailer, also in HD. Uh, pretty cool. They have all the special features in that high definition, taking some some advantage of the Blu-ray format. Uh, there you can see 109 minutes. What is it? 1981 or 2 or something? Somewhere is in there. 1980-something, man. I don't see a release here, but there, there, are not, there is 1981. Very small font. Uh, there is a digital copy included as well, so if anyone would like a free digital copy of Dragon Slayer, drop a comment. Uh, first person to do so will get it. Now let's see if this disc is in order. Ooh, I guess that sounds good. Rattling all around in there. Luckily it is a Blu-ray, so it is uh, somewhat scratch resistant. little paper slip and the disc fell as I did so. Uh, there we can see the disc not too much to look at, kind of bland for such a visual movie. The disc itself in good shape on the bottom uh, and you do get a full solid case to protect said disc. Uh, I don't like, I can see why it came loose, this top button here does not want to, there it goes, does not want to click in. Don't like that, we'll probably swap this case out at some point but uh Finally have the original Dragon Slayer on Blu-ray, as well as uh, Dawn of the Dragon Slayer, which uh, comes with no special features. So uh, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen.